ladies and gentlemen, we are at the Sporting Goods store on the third floor of the BQ Mall. And I have come here for a very specific item that they don't have in stock now two years. Two years, they're out of stock for the same item that I have come to look for. But this gentleman here, he's been stringing these rackets, and I always catch him at the end of the racket. So I want to show you how this is done. These are done by hand here in the Philippines. But how do you know how much pressure to put on the on the cable? This this is the meter. Uh, how do you know how how much tension? This one, sir. It will say. It will tell you. Yes, sir. Automatic. Yes, sir. Automatic, sir. Can you can see it over there? Yes, sir. Polly hold. Yes, sir. Ah, okay. So, the the uh, meter here, you set this for anything you like, yeah? Yes, sir. So you could set it for 10,000 pounds? No, sir. One million? No, sir. Two million? No, sir. Not, not no. possible. Yes, sir. And, ha and this is set for 45 kilos? Pounds, sir, pounds. 45 pounds? Yes, sir. So 45 pounds of tensile strength on the racket, and that's all done automatically by whipping the wire around this this is called this is called a shiv s h i v and this locks the locks the straw the strand down in there while the shiv applies pressure 45 pounds of pressure i think that's pretty interesting so do so this is a used tennis racket, yeah? Yes, sir, tennis racket. Okay. So what is the what is the approximate cost to restring the tennis racket? Cost to put the new the new strands. What is the approximate cost? Pila. Uh, more than 500 zel. 500 pesos, yes, sir. Uh, roughly, roughly 500 pesos. Well, that's really interesting. I, I've never seen a video like this on YouTube, but I will put this up tomorrow. Do you wish to say your name, but not your face? Yes, sir. It's okay, sir. Your, your face is okay? No. <laughs> but your name. What is your name? Norman Aurelio. Norman. Yes, sir. Okay, Norman. My name is Michael Fazio, and I will put the name of the store up on the uh, BQ sports store is that okay yes sir it's okay sir. and bq sports store norman the tennis pro you're a tennis pro today norman yeah that's what you are my friend all right i want i wish to thank you thank you for the education okay no problem sir okay well i never saw a tennis racket get strung up before and i thought that was pretty amazing and Norman was nice enough to have us, uh, have us, and now we have us because we have uh, we have some pet dogs in the bag. So Norman was nice enough to have us in the store, and this is a sporting goods store in Tagbalaran. What is the name of this store, Polly Hogan? Sports World. Sir. Sports World. Sports World. And they have quite the assortment of sports gear all things considered however the thing that I have been asking them to order for three years um, is still not possible to order I find that interesting I find it amazing I find it absolutely amazing that they won't make a special order and I will also say welcome to the Philippines if it's not in their inventory, in their uh, workbook or their sheets, it's simply just not possible to get something special ordered. So with that, God day to everybody from Michael Fazio in the Philippines from Sports World. Yeah, baby.